Are you wondering if you should change your last name now that your divorce is final? To change or not to change? This is a great question. And I've had a lot of people ask me this, and I feel like this is an important topic to discuss. Whether or not to change your name after divorce is a personal decision, and it depends on you as an individual and the circumstances, preferences, and the reasons you have for considering a name change in the first place. I have had friends that changed their name back to their maiden name because they didn't want to be associated with what their last name represented. Others wanted to establish a new identity or a new direction. Some wanted to start fresh. I decided to keep my last name for many of the reasons I'm going to share today. Most importantly, I have had this last name my entire adult life, like since I was 21. I've been in the public. I created a life as Maisha Cheney. I have all my professional licenses and my RN license, my real estate license, site supervisor permits. I have all my degrees in my last name. I was ordained with this name. I have a lot of history, a lot of baggage. I had an 850 credit score with this name, baby, okay? I still have a child that's 12 and I weighed that into the equation. Now I have wanted to change it so very badly and I have even taken the steps to do so. But at this moment right now, I will leave my last name as it is. I plan to marry again, so I figured I can change it then, but this is truly a decision that's personal. Here are some things I think you should consider when deciding whether or not to change your last name after divorce. That this is a personal preference. Your name is a significant part of your identity and it's essential to choose a name that feels right for you. So some people drop it on social and they have a different name. They use their first and their middle name. Some people change it legally, but they leave it socially. If you feel strongly about reverting to your maiden name or adopting a new name that better reflects your identity post-divorce, changing your name may be the right decision for you. There are some practical considerations like changing your name after divorce can involve some legal, some administrative, some financial considerations. You have to update it on all kinds of important documents, your driver's license, passport, social security card, bank accounts, all these things. Now, I've met people that say, please, I will hurry up and do it. Give me the pen. Let's sign it and get it done because they're just so tired at that point and just want to be far away from what their old life represented. These things take time, effort, and they cost. So when you think about changing your name, think about the practical things. Then you got to think about the professional things. If you have a professional career or some sort of identity that you've established under your married name, changing your name may impact your professional relationships, um, networks, your personal brand. I thought about the last 18 years being associated as Maisha Cheney. We've been on reality TV shows as that. There's so much that I've just, it'll take 10, 15 years for people to know my maiden name because they come up to me and they talk to me as they always have. And they approach me as, Hey, Miss Cheney. Hey, Maisha Cheney. Hey, it's just, it's just natural. And I feel like that's okay. People don't have to know the whole story and I just let them be however they want to be. But it's important to consider how changing your name may affect your career and other implications in your brand or whatever. The other thing are the children. If you have children, from your marriage and you share the last name, changing your name may impact their sense of identity. Consider how your name change affects them and discuss it with them if they're old enough to understand, like have a conversation that this is what I'm considering. How does this affect you at school with your friends? All those kind of intangible things that we don't think about. I personally just left it. I have an 18, a 17 and a 12 year old and I'm like, she's 12. Let me get her on to high school before I start changing things, okay? There are emotional factors. A name change can be a symbolic way of closing a chapter of your life and embracing a new beginning. So if changing your name feels empowering and helps you move forward from your marriage, then this may be a positive step for your emotional well-being, saying, I am not this, I am now this. 
But ultimately, the decision to change your name is a personal one. There's no right. There's no wrong. And guess what? There's no time constraints. I feel like if I wake up tomorrow and say I'm changing it, I am changing it. It doesn't matter what I say right now. Take the time to reflect on your reasons. And for me, if it wasn't a heck yeah, do it now, then I'm gonna wait. Reflect on your reasons for considering the name change and weigh the practical, weigh the emotional, talk to the kids and make a decision that aligns with your values and your goals for your post-divorce life. And if you're unsure, just pray about it, talk to friends about it, talk to your therapist about it, but make an informed decision. I feel like you can't go wrong. You can't mess this up. You're on the other side, you're moving forward. Um, you are who you are and it doesn't really matter what your last name is, but do what feels good for you. You've been through enough. And if you wanna scratch that thing off and become whoever you wanna be, I say do it. If you wanna keep it for reasons that are meaningful to you, then keep it. Let me know in the comments, are you gonna change your name? Are you gonna keep your last name? What do you plan on doing? And if you didn't know, I'm Aisha, author, speaker, content creator, and your new best friend. I am living my authentic life and helping others do the same. If you haven't already, like, subscribe, and please let me know in the comments which way are you leaning to change it or not to change it. I want to know. Peace.